Hello and welcome. I am the Suit and Tie Dip and Chew Guy and this is channel news for the 3rd of July 2021. This is channel news and an announcement. The announcement will be at the end or towards the end. I will be running through this at a rate trying to keep the time down so people will actually watch it through to the announcement so I don't have to explain in comment sections for months on end as to what I'm covering right now. Silly me. Anyway, okay, so first order of business, I wish you all a very happy 4th of July. Be safe, be careful, etc. All right. Uh, moving from that, chronograph. Chronograph was a fail. I pulled donations for that. For those that donated, I will let you know what your donations are going for. You shouldn't be disturbed at all. Um, the problem was, I, the donations came in. That was fine. Uh, it covered about half the price of it. And I was going to cover the other half. Again, no problem. Um, Amazon ran out of them. And they only had them through third-party sellers. And, of course, the third-party sellers weren't selling it at the Amazon price. It went up about $26, which was putting it at... Actually, it might have been more than $26. It, 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 it was over $100. It was, it was cruising towards 115 when the shipping was tacked on. And, of course, it was third-party, so there was going to be shipping tacked on. So, there were other options in chronograph which would have been around the original price point that i had envisioned but i did not have them researched and was not overly confident with their abilities with nerf i'm sure what they're made for which the one was airsoft i'm sure they're fine for that they're highly rated in fact but a 20 caliber plastic bb and a 50 caliber foam dart are two very different things. So I passed on the chronograph. What happened with the donation money? It has already been sent out. It sourced tobacco. All right. It sourced tobacco content for the channel. It funded, I sourced, it funded the sourcing of the tobacco. So we will have at least one, what is it, review, short format dip review. One long format chew review and it also got a couple other things that will be worked in to a new playlist a new series smokeless tobacco series is coming it involves two products in one video so the price tag goes up obviously so again the monetization monetized rather videos are becoming ever more important Upcoming, as I said, we're going to have a new tobacco series, Smokeless Tobacco. It will be in between dip and chew. It, it will be covering both, okay? Um, it will be coming within the next couple of weeks on a Tuesday night. There is going to be a long format chew review, all right? And at least one what is it review, which is the short format dip series beyond that as extra content i will not remove a review of anything for this i will be doing another beginners video for this channel for beginners this channel i've already done one but since i've done that the channel has changed a lot and i'm trying to cut down when answering questions and i'm also trying to spur people to watch the monetized content and what the playlists are for that moving on the announcement okay so coming this november i will be selling memberships the memberships are for a very particular playlist that will be coming all right the playlist will be titled somewhere along the lines, Headlines, and will fall on every Saturday. 
starting in December. The first Saturday, I believe, is the anniversary of Pearl Harbor. It is December 7th. But I will open up the membership process sometime in November. The headlines. This is political stuff. So I always hear people saying, oh, I really wish you were doing the political stuff. But then there's other people that are like, we love your reviews, but we'd really not rather not hear about your politics. That's fine. Anybody that wants to hear political stuff buys the membership. And we will see how that goes. I will set it very low, whatever the lowest threshold is. I believe it'll be like $1.99 a month. That's what I'm hoping for. All right. I haven't gone too far into it with YouTube yet. All right. So the, what is it? Headlines. Basically, instead of hearing my own personal opinions, which is just that opinion for the most part, it's based in fact, but really at the end of the day, it is my own opinion. You will be read off the things I read that allow me to form my opinions. Okay, so this will not be so much me telling you what I think. You'll be able to put that together by seeing or hearing or both what I am forming my opinions on. So the video will be basically conservative lean headlines that caught my attention for the prior week. So if the video falls on a Saturday, it will be headlines I read through the previous Sunday up to that Saturday, most of them falling during the weekdays. I will be reading off the headline, the site that I got the headline from, and the day that it was published, all right? I will also be linking all of the headlines directly in the description area. It will basically be, in a way, sort of a video format news aggregator, if that makes any sense. Uh, for those that were, before it went completely off the hinges, familiar with the Drudge Report, it'll be something like that with not as quite as many articles, although I'm not sure yet. It'll depend what I think the video link should be. It may be ones that really grab my attention, I read all the way through, or it may be ones that I read all the way through, and some that I skim all the way through. Uh, I'm not exactly sure how it's going to fall, but it will be the headline, the date it was published, and the site it was published on. Okay? So, it will sort of be like what Drudge Report used to be, only not quite as extensive. Okay, I will be trying to keep it to the important stuff. So memberships will be opening at a very low price in November. And then on the first Saturday of December, which I believe is December 7th, I will start this and it will go every Saturday. All right. And as I said, I will read off what it is. There will be at least 20 that are read off and then links, direct links for all of them. There is very loose ideas of expansion on the membership side of things. I wanted to see if memberships would work. One, I wanted to do something political, but didn't really want to turn people off by doing it. So this way, if you really want to know, it's going to cost $1.99 a month. Okay. I had thought about pushing YouTube and seeing if I could get it lower than that, but then I was like, I don't know if anybody wants anything lower. They probably don't even want a dollar ninety nine charged a month or whatever. I would take it off PayPal if you have PayPal personally, but you know. So that is that. Uh, I will be coming back on Monday night, the fifth, with a bubblegum review. It is another Big League Chew product. It is already recorded. I will be back on Tuesday. Tuesday, I'm not quite sure if a delivery is going to be here by Tuesday. Normally, I said it would be, but with the holiday, I don't know how goofed up the postal service is going to be. So, in case 
it is not here. I do have a backup, but it might be a little bit sort of, oh, what, what, why is he posting this? And then on Wednesday of this coming week, there will be an Australian beef jerky. A big bag. Uh, an actual large bag of beef jerky uh, that Michael Wallace funded and sourced, supplied. Anyway, I do hope you all are well. Do take care of yourselves, and as always, God bless.